Is there anything I do to make myself feel better? Yeah, the one of my biggest things to make myself better is like boxing, obviously. I'm like obsessed. Because it, it clears my head in a second. You need to do the moves. So you just have to forget about everything that's been happening outside of that room. Like I'll blare music really loud in my bedroom and just be like, just it's just like something that is like so away from me or like listening to someone that's like, got like going through an emotional thing, like amazing songwriters. I do this one thing. I love going to, um, to art shops or to a hardware shop because to me, if you go into a hardware shop, it's just like, you've just got so many possibilities in life. You can just make whatever you want and that, that makes me really happy. So I'll just go in there and I'll walk around. I'll probably buy a new sketchbook. Having a nice full on lunch with uh, brunch drinks and everything included, just me by myself. Oh, it's very good. My dad taught me how to make a fire when I was about six years old. Making a fire always makes me feel better because it's so methodical. And then you create the thing and it's just, I love watching fires as well. So that whole, that whole process always makes me feel a lot better. I need to have my own my own moments, like get by myself. Whenever I feel frustrated, like I have like week of things that are going bad and I feel like frustration coming up. And usually just being by myself, like going gardening. Um, it's just, just being in nature in general. Routine is key. Routine is key. It's super key. So part of our addiction was not waking up on time, not being there on time, not being there for friends, family. Think about how much time we spent picking up, using, being a complete mess. So now we can do those things in a more proactive way. I mean, we both need to go to far more meetings. Sometimes for me, the leaving situation is better than confronting it at that point. I don't know if that's the best way, but for me, um, that's the only way where I wouldn't explode in a sense. And once then I found my center again, it's over too. It's just the finding that moment where you're not gonna go overboard. And it's very difficult. And I'm still struggling with that a lot. Um, I've got the best family and friends a girl could ask for. And I think anyone will know that when, that when you're feeling down and just to go talk to your mom or your dad or your sister or your best friend, or anything and just talk to them. Um, and they just always know how to cheer you up. And that, I think, is probably the most universal, but also the most important, the most important one.